When I first started in the game, I pretty much uh, had to rely on uh, a couple of online tutorials to learn how to book loads. So I would jump online and, uh, you know, I, I called my first broker. i never forget, I got my truck on the road, ready to go, had the driver in there. And I said, all right, cool, I'm ready to do this. I hopped on the load board. Um, I called this first, first broker that I saw. I said, hey, I got a truck ready to go in Atlanta. She said, yeah, I got a load in South Carolina. Um, it's picking up in South Carolina and it goes down to South Georgia. So she was like, I said, how much is it paying? She was like, it's paying like 700 bucks. I said, okay, cool, that sounds really good. You know, first day of business, 700, that's a good day. We went 200 miles to South Carolina, picked the load up, and we drove right past Atlanta, straight to South Georgia, 700 bucks. Ended up using 350 in gas, and then paid my driver like 250 or something like that. Uh, ended up doing charity work by the time we came back. <laughs> so I learned at that moment, like, okay, this is not as easy as it looks. When you get on the phone with these shippers or these brokers and you're, you're calling them for a load, um, at the end of the day, they realize the, the least that they pay you is the more that they make. So uh, you get on the phone with these guys and they can just get a slight sense that you're new or you don't know what you're talking about, they're gonna get you. So the dispatch service pretty much is like training wheels. Uh, you know, for a new trucking company. Um, we're gonna get on the phone and negotiate on your behalf um, with the expertise and the knowledge of the market to know, okay, this truck is supposed to get this much out of this market, okay? So a lot of times when you're just starting off in the game, um, you'll call and say, hey, look, um, I got a truck in Atlanta, I wanna go to Virginia. Um, whatever rate they give you is gonna sound good. It's still money, but if you don't know from Atlanta to Virginia, I'm supposed to be charging $1,500. And the broker offers you $1,000. $1,000 still sounds good to you. What happens is when you consistently do loads and you're undercutting yourself, it starts to catch up to you. Um, and that's what happened to me. I was booking loads uh, under market value for a few months. And then three, four, five months down the line, it caught up to me. I started realizing, wow, I'm making money, but it's not staying. It's way more money going out in gas in my driver than I'm keeping. So the dispatch service, uh, we trained our, our dispatchers and you know, these guys, are, you know, they're getting on the phone and they're negotiating relentlessly. We're, we're trying to get every single dollar possible for the clients to make sure that you guys at the end of the month, at the end of the year, those numbers are making sense and those margins are, are good. Another benefit uh, here at Good Energy Consultants is uh, um, a lot of dispatch services. I've noticed uh, you have one dispatcher for 20 to 25 trucks. Uh, you're sitting around waiting for loads. With us, we're not giving one dispatcher more than five to seven trucks. So pretty much there's a level of priority and a level of attentiveness that we give to all these trucks. Our dispatchers have developed a really good relationships with the drivers. Um, we communicate and we find out, okay, you know, what areas does that driver like to drive into? You know, what areas does the driver not want to go to? Um, we pretty much make it very um, friendly for the drivers and we make sure that they're, they're, they're comfortable at all times. Our dispatchers, they have a quota every week. Um, you know, we have a certain number that my guys know that they have to hit every week. We came up with this number based off, the, uh, off, a, off a strong week um, that we know companies will be able to make profits um, on a monthly basis at. The dispatch service is important, uh, especially for people who um, are not negotiators. You know, it might take you a little time to, you know, really grasp on what this industry uh, requires. It's a year minimum to get into the dispatch service. And within that year, uh, some of the clients, they kind of shadow us and they kind of see what we do and they learn actually from just us dispatching it and just paying attention to how we're working the trucks. Within a year, you might say, hey, look, uh, I've learned, I've shadowed, and I feel comfortable. I want to take it over now. Or in a year, you could say, hey, look, uh, it's not broke. <laughs> no need to fix it. I'll go ahead and uh, renew for another year. Um, the dispatch service is basically um, us just making sure that you guys get the best opportunity possible to make those profits and make your investment back in that first year.